Good morning, dear faithful. We thank God once again for bringing us together here in our sanctuary to offer this beautiful prayer service to asking for the supplications, the help, the intercessions from St. Anastasia, known as the one who helps those who have mental health concerns and then also any addictions as well. So we offer this service on a monthly basis to continue to ask for her intercessions. Let us pray together at this time. Blessed is our God, always, now, and ever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. Come, let us worship and bow down before our King and God. Come, let us worship and fall down before Christ, our King and God. Come, let us worship and fall down before Christ, our King and our God. O oh Lord, hear my prayer. Give ear to my supplications in your truth. Hear me in your righteousness. Do not enter into judgment with your servant, for in your sight no one living is justified. For the enemy has persecuted my soul. He has crushed my life to the ground. He has made me dwell in darkness like those who have long been dead, and my spirit is overwhelmed within me. My heart within me is distressed. I remember the days of old. I meditated on all your works. I pondered on the work of your hands. I spread out my hands to you. My soul longs for you like a thirsty land. Hear me quickly, O Lord. My spirit fails. Do not turn your face away from me, lest I be like those who go down into the pit. Cause me, cause me to hear your mercy in the morning, for in you I have put my trust. Cause me to know, O Lord, the way in which I should walk for I lift up my soul to you. Rescue me, Lord, from my enemies. To you I fled for refuge. Teach me to do your will, for you are my God. Your good spirit shall lead me in the land of uprightness. For your name's sake, O Lord, you shall quicken me. In your righteousness you shall bring my soul out of trouble, and in your mercy you shall utterly destroy my enemies, and you shall destroy all those who afflict my soul, for I am your servant. Lord, give thanks to the Lord and call upon his holy name. God is the Lord and has revealed himself to us. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. All the nations have surrounded me, but in the name of the Lord I have overcome them. God is the Lord and has revealed himself to us. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. This has been done by the Lord and it is wonderful in our eyes. God is the Lord and has revealed himself to us. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Since you are quick to heal all those who are, 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 are ailing, you are the resurrection, O fallen of martyr. Therefore, O Anastasia, we cry to you, save us from the storms of life which are caused by the devil. For you have attained on high in the kingdom great boldness. Therefore, we entreat to our God and Master Christ, a virgin martyr of Rome, we praise your name. Glory to the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit, both now and ever to the ages of ages. Amen. O Theotokos, we shall never be silent of your mighty acts. O we, the unworthy, had you not stood to intercede for us from the numerous perils, who would have preserved us all until now with our freedom? O Lady, we shall not depart from you, for you always save your servants from all tribulation. Have mercy on me, O God, according to your great mercy, and according to the multitude of your compassion, blot out our transgression. Wash me thoroughly from my iniquity and cleanse me from my sin, for I acknowledge my iniquity and my sin is ever before me. 
Against you, you only, have I sinned and done this evil in your sight, and you may be found just when you speak and blameless when you judge. For behold, I was conceived in iniquity and in sin my mother before me. For behold, you have loved truth. You have made known to me the secret things of your wisdom. You shall sprinkle me with hyssop, and I shall be made clean. You shall wash me, and I shall be whiter than snow. Make me to hear joy and gladness, that bones which you have broken may rejoice. Turn your face away from my sins and blot out all my iniquities. Create in me a clean heart, O God, and renew a steadfast spirit within me. Do not cast me away from your presence and do not take your Holy Spirit from me. Restore to me the joy of your salvation and establish me with your governing spirit. I shall teach transgressors your way and the ungodly shall turn back to you. Deliver me from blood guiltiness, O God, the God of my salvation. My tongue shall rejoice in your righteousness. O oh Lord, open my lips, and my mouth shall show forth your praise. For if you had desired sacrifice, I would give it. You do not delight in burnt offering. A sacrifice to God is a broken spirit. God will not despise a broken and humbled heart. Do good in your good pleasure to Sion, and let the walls of Jerusalem be built. Then you shall be pleased with a sacrifice of righteousness, with oblation and whole burnt offerings. Then they shall offer bulls on your altar. O saint of God, intercede for us. Since you are kind and benevolent, O great virgin martyr, now incline graciously to us and rescue our souls, O Anastasia, for you have found grace and boldness with Christ our God. Stop it. So you just say, O saint of God, intercede for us, and we'll alternate there. Okay. O saint of God, intercede for us. Since you are kind and benevolent, O great virgin martyr, now incline graciously to us and rescue our souls, O Anastasia. Anastasia, For you have found grace and boldness with Christ our God. O saint of God, intercede for us from the causes of stumblings, O righteous one. Deliver your servants and become unto us as a guide to lead us by the grace of, unto salvation. For you now dwell with Christ our God the way of life. Glory to the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. From on high, bedew us with grace-filled balm, O Saint Anastasia, and your mystical medicines, and wondrously rescue all your, all your servants. From all addictions to drugs, we call on you. Both now and ever to the ages of ages, amen. Do you cleanse my soul of passion's filth? O most holy mother, all immaculate bride of God, forsake me not in my sins, but grant to me victorious over the enemies. O Saint of God, intercede for us. By your pure intercessions, do you cleanse all of the wounds of our wretched souls, drug defiled now, and purify our minds for you, O saint, have found in Christ the glorious kingdom, boldness to deliver and to those who pray unto you. The apse of the heavens are you, O Lord, fashioner, and the holy church is great founder. Likewise establish me in constant love for you, for you are for you're the height of our longing, support of the faithful, the only friend of all. O saint of God, intercede for us from all grievous afflictions, despondency, great despair and enslavement to vile narcotics. Do you now deliver us who run unto you? Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. On all those who are bent down, enslaved, addicted to drugs, do you sprinkle down the sublime dew of, all, of your all healing grace? For we all turn to you since you are full of compassion, blessed Anastasia, you the martyr of Christ our God. Both now and ever to the ages of ages, amen. O you radiant vessel of Christ, the true light of the world, you bright dawn star of the great day star. O Theotokos made, do you now shine on us the light of saving repentance, for we have been darkened by passions and grievous sins. Raise them from their plight, all those who fervently pray to you, Anastasia. Grant them grace and strength to overcome the foes' wily snares, and lead them as one saved unto the Savior. Turn to me in your good favor, all praiseworthy Theotokos. You look upon my grave illnesses, which painfully sting my flesh and heal the cause of my soul's pain and suffering. 
By the streams of your cures, O saint, and the great miracles, you scattered all our grievous deeds as the chaff in the wind, and bring unto us in our troubled hearts the light of your purity. And so Anastasia, we pray, be renowned, O martyr, for our soul's defense. O saint of God, intercede for us. Though I seek by my sinfulness to depart from Christ our God, the source of all endless life, O righteous one, lead me back, for I now find myself in great despondency. Saint of God, intercede for us. Let your sheltering care, O saint, be a most effective and wondrous antidote for all those who suffer harm in mind and in body also from their substance abuse. Glory to the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Do you ever repel from all the oppressive onslaught caused by the evil one of addiction to drug, destructive drugs for you are the deliverer of God's grace? Both now and forever into the ages of ages, amen. With your grace, as with sacred dew, do you ever nourish and cool my barren soul? For you gave birth unto our God, who came down from heaven to restore all men. O saint of God, intercede for us, and by your miracles and your healings, show throughout the world you become, O saint, most eminent. For you do hearken unto us, unto the world to come. Saint of God, intercede for us. You are seen to be a sure helper for all those in need, for you do calm the tempest of our storms by coming to us from on high and shining beams of grace. Glory to the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. From the evil urge to take drugs and from depression's woes that come from substance that harm the mind, O Anastasia, rescue us, for we now pray unto you both now and forever into the ages of ages, amen. Rescue me, O maid, from temptations from my senselessness, has led me to the depths of sinfulness, but draw me out from Satan's snares, O wondrous bride of God. Saint of God, intercede for us. I lie now like the most foolish prodigal, wounded unto death by many dark passions for our cruel foe, the vile man-hating devil, has led us into the pit of despondency, but hasten now to raise me up and deliver my soul from this snare, O Christ. Saint of God, intercede for us. Since you are compassionate and dear to God, O great martyr, truly wise Anastasia, do, your, do you vouchsafe to all those drug addicted their liberation and healing and soul and mind and mystical turn all their gloom into gladness and freedom in Christ our God? Glory to the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit, the master of all creation, O Christ our God, has made you for us, O Saint Anastasia, by grace divine, a most skillful physician to free our bodies and souls from addicted drugs. And therefore we now come to you to receive perfect healing, O righteous one. Both now and forever into the ages of ages, amen. I have not obeyed the words of Christ my God, who gave unto me his saving commandments, but I have, I have strayed on the part of the devil and have become, O, la o my lady, a mockery. But lead me back to Christ's great fold, since you are his pure mother, O bride of God. Raise them from their plight, all those who fervently pray to you, Anastasia. Grant them grace and strength to overcome the foes while he snares and lead them as one saved unto the Savior. Spotless one, who by a word did bring to us the word eternal, by the last days ineffably to you now plead with us with the motherly favor. By your mystic care, O saint, Heal our souls' passions, which are loathsome, and lead us into grievous sin, and deem us worthy of your great care, until we come to the prayers of the realms on high. From the years of my youth, many passions combat me, but you who are my Savior, assist me and save me. You haters of Zion shall be put to shame by the Lord Almighty. For as grass in the fire, you shall all be withered. Glory to the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. By the Holy Spirit, every soul is made living, is exalted through the shining purification of the threefold oneness in a hidden manner. Now and forever, 
and unto the ages of ages, amen. By the Holy Spirit, the streams of grace are flowing, watering all of the creation, granting life upon it. Let us pray to the Lord our God that we may deem worthy to hear the Holy Gospel. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Wisdom arise, let us hear the Holy Gospel. Peace be with you all and with your spirit. Let us attend the reading of the Holy Gospel according to St. Matthew. Let us be attentive. Glory to you, O Lord. Glory to you. The Lord said unto his disciples, Behold, I send you out as sheep in the midst of wolves. So be wise as serpents and innocent as doves. Beware of men, for they will deliver you up to councils and flog you in their synagogues. And you will be dragged before governors and kings for my sake to bear testimony before them and the Gentiles. When they deliver you up, do not be anxious how you are to speak or what you are to say. For what you are to say will be given to you in that hour. For it is not you who speak, but the Spirit of the Father speaking through you. Brother will deliver up brother to death, and father his child. And children will rise against parents and have them put to death. And you will be hated for my name's sake. But he who endures to the end will be saved. Glory Glory to to you, O Lord. Glory Glory to to you. Glory to the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, now and ever to the ages of ages. Amen. At the intercessions of the prize winner, O Lord of mercy, blot out my offenses, now and ever to the ages of ages. Amen. At the intercessions of the Theotokos, O Lord, blot out my many offenses. Have mercy on me, O God, according to your great mercy and according to the abundance of your compassion. Blot out my transgressions as a ceaseless fount of cures for our defiled souls and bodies. You do send gentle rain, O divine and of divine and healing grace on those who are parched with sin by your firm prayers to God. Free us from enslavement to all things that lead our hearts astray. Keep us, your supplicants, from the cunning schemes of the enemy. Deliver us, we beg of you, from the abyss, the dark abyss of despondency, O wondrous Anastasia, victorious prize winner of Christ God, as you do triumph against the foes, fill our souls with strength divine. O God, save your people and bless your inheritance. Visit your world in mercy and compassion. Exalt the horn of Orthodox Christians and send down on us your rich mercies. Through the intercession of the whole pure lady, the Theotokos and ever Virgin Mary, the power of the precious and life-giving cross, protection of the honorable bodiless powers of heaven, the supplications of the honorable glorious prophet and foreigner John the Baptist, of Peter and Paul the Twelve and the seventy all holy apostles, and of the apostles to America, Herman the Apostle to America, and of our Father among the saints, great ecumenical teachers and hierarchs, Basil the Great, Gregory the Theologian, and John Chrysostom, of Athanasius and Cyril, John the Merciful Patriarchs of Alexandria, Nicholas of Myra, Spirit of Donatrimitus, Nectarius of Pendopolis, and John of San Francisco, the Wonder Workers, of our Holy and God-bearing Fathers, the saints, innocent and Tikhon and Lightners of America, Raphael of Brooklyn, Marjorie of Chicago, the holy proto-martyr and archdeacon Stephen, the holy glorious great martyrs, George of Victorious, Demetrius the Merce Dreaming, Theodore the Recruit, Theodore the General and Minas the Wonder Worker, of Eleftherios, Heralambos, John, Alexander and Juvenali the Priest Martyrs, of the Holy Glorious Great Martyrs, Thecla, Barbara, Anastasia, whose paraclesis we offer today, Catherine, Kiriaki, Fotini, Marina, Pariskivi, and Dyrene, of Peter the Aleut and Proto-Martyr of North America, of the Holy Glorious Victorious 179 Martyrs, of the Del Pendelis Monastery, of Kirikos, and the unmercenary healer Pandalemon, of the priest confessor Alexis of Pennsylvania, Jacob of Alaska and Sebastian of San Francisco, and of our venerable and God-bearing fathers of the holy ascetics, of the evangelist and apostle Mark, patron of this holy church, the righteous ancestors of God, Joachim and Anna, of St. Gerasimus, the righteous of the Jordan, Paul and his sister Juliana and their companions, Daniel, the prince of Moscow, 
Gregory, the Bishop of Constance, and all the saints that we remember today, we beseech you, the only all merciful Lord, hear the prayers of us sinners and have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Yara Burham, Yara Burham, Yara Burham, Domnim Mieste, Demnum Mieste, Demnum Mueste, Kidia Laison, Kidia Laison, Kidia Laison. By the mercy and compassion and love of your only begotten Son, with whom you are blessed, together with your all holy life, good and life giving Spirit, now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. O saint of God, intercede for us. By your holy supplications, now enable us, O wondrous Anastasia, to live our life in peace, to glorify the Savior by the shining forth in piety as we keep his purest commandments. Saint of God, intercede for us. Quench by your grace our evil passions and dispel from those enslaved their evil yearning to partake of their harm of poisonous narcotics and pray that Christ God give to them his true freedom in the spirit. Glory to the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. With great passion look upon me in my lowliness and my misery, O great martyr, as the one strong to rescue me, release me from addictions, and free me from their ill effects by your mighty intercessions. Both now and forever and to the ages of ages, amen. Hearken, O Virgin Theotokos, to my voice and to my grieved soul's inner sighings. For with faith I pray to you, to save me from afflictions and from the wrath that is to come. For in heart I am grief-stricken. O saint of God, intercede for us by thy great skill, O saint, in cultivation. Now uproot from our souls, from the souls of your tr tormented servants, the roots of evil yearnings for addicted drugs, and instill a yearning in them, O great martyr, for a life in incorruption. Saint of God, intercede for us. Never cease to watch over us, O martyr. Show thy great care for us, O wondrous Anastasia. Deliver us, thy servants, from our enemies, for thou hast found boldness with the King of glory, who crowned you in the heavens. Glory to the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Thine all-venerable icon, sacred icon, showeth forth with God's grace from above, with quench it, which quencheth drug addictions, and doth ever soothe and vivify the souls of all those enslaved by every passion, which slay the soul and body, both now and ever to the ages of ages, amen. O thou all purest immaculate, blessed Theotoko, save us from the, our foe and his death bringing counsels, for he doth ever seek to slay the flock of Christ by beguiling all those, heeding to his falsehoods and straying from the shepherd. Saint of God, intercede for us by your sure medi medications. O wise Anastasia, now heal the bodies of those who approach you in faith, and having cured their, their addictions, establish their wayward souls. Saint of God, intercede for us. By thy strong med mediations, make our Lord and Savior the only true friend of man to be gracious to us that by his wondrous compassion we may abide with you. Glory to the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, now and ever to the ages of ages, amen. I come to you, O martyr, with soul and body which have been wounded by sin and addiction to drugs, but heal me by your great grace and mercy to lead me to an endless life. Both now and forever, and unto the ages of ages, amen. You, O pure Theotokos, are seen as a great throne, for you did hold in your womb Christ, true King and God. Thus, having with him great boldness, grant us unending life. Truly, you are worthy to be blessed, Mother of our God, the Theotokos. You, the ever-blessed one, and all blameless one, and the Mother of our God. Greater in honor than the cherubim, and in glory greater, beyond compare than the seraphim. You, without corruption, give birth to God the Word, and are truly Theotokos. You do, we magnify. Inai makaris ton ke panamomiton ke mitara tu theuimon tim tim iotaeran ton kiaruvim ke endokso teeran asikritos ton serafim tinadi avtoros theologon de kusan tinondos theotokos megalinon men 
Truly you are worthy to be blessed, Mother of our God, the Theotokos, you the ever-blessed and all-blameless one, and the Mother of our God. You are honored more than the cherubim, and in glory greater beyond compare than the seraphim. You without corruption gave birth to God the Word, and are truly Theotokos, you do we magnify. Axion estinos alithos, makaris in satin teotokon, dinai makaris ton ke panamomiton, ke mitara tu theu imon, timti mi oteran ton keruvim, ke endoxo teran asikritos ton serapim, dinadi avtoros eologon de kusan, dinondo seotokon, Se megalinoman. And make us worthy, O Master, to with boldness and with confidence to declare you the Holy God as Father and to say, Our Father, who art Lord in heaven, heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will, will be, be done, done on earth as it is in heaven. Give, give us this day our daily bread, bread and forgive us our trespasses, trespasses as we, we forgive, forgive those who trespass, trespass against, against us. us. And, and lead us not into temptation, temptation but deliver us from evil. evil. For yours the kingdom and the power and the glory of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit, now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Have mercy on us, O Lord, have mercy on us, for with nothing to say in our defense, we sinners offer this supplication to you as Master, have mercy on us. Glory to the Father and to the Son and the Holy Spirit. Lord, have mercy on us, for in you we trust. Be not enraged with us greatly, nor remember our iniquities. But look upon us now, being compassionate, and deliver us from our enemies. For you are our God, and we are your people. All of us, the work of your hands, and now we have invoked your name. Both now and ever to the ages of ages, amen. Open the gate of compassion for us. O blessed Theotokos, for in hoping in you, let us not fail in our aim. Through you may we may be delivered from adversities for you are the salvation of the Christian people. Have mercy on us, O God, according to your great mercy. We pray you hear us and have mercy. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Again, we pray for all pious and orthodox Christians. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Again, we pray for our Archbishop Alexios, and all the brotherhood in Christ. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Again we pray, O Lord, for mercy, life, peace, health, salvation, visitation, forgiveness, and remission of the sins of the servants of God, all pious and orthodox Christians, those residing and visiting in this city, the stewards, members, and parish council and benefactors of this holy church, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Again we pray, O oh Lord, for your servants, Devorin, Christos, Haralambos, Jared, Adrian, Alexandru, Anna, Katina, Lucas, Cindy, Greg, Dimitri, Christos, Demos, Iakovos, Alexander, Cassandra, Aaron, George, Aleko, Alex, Asimo, Michael, Michael, Catherine, Audrey, Johnny, Arturo, Arturo and family, Mark, Alex, Athena, Heather and Keith, Andrew, Carter, Sotiria, Nicholas and Marina, Billy, Dimitri, and for your servants, O Lord, Josephine, Sierra, Olivia, Nick, Vanessa, Mary, Grace, Stephanie, Tina, Madison, Betsy, Ava, Madison, Sam, Constantine, Mia, Mia, Jean, Ava, Zoe, Stephanie, Mallory, Natalia, Lisa, Maria, Christian, Vasi, Eleni, Hanan, Noel, James, Alex, Alexa, Mortici, Vanna, Anna, Christy, Michael, Lisa, Melissa, Melissa, Paul, John, Brittany, Ava, Michaela, Grace, Melissa, Amanda, Mariella, Emily, Linda, Greta, Kyra, Hayes, Odette, Danielle, Lisa, Cassandra, Sloan, Joseph, Jessica, Kenzie, Aiden, Angel Angelica, Melissa, Brian, Michael, Victoria, Theophon, Alex, Alex, Isidoros, Tanner, Steve, Paul, Sophia, Luke, Georgia, Peter, Alethidia, Constantine, Ale Alexa, Barbara, Jonathan, Joseph, Rebecca, Kim, Harris, Athena, Aaron, Timothy, Kristen, Dionysios, Faye, Jim, Julianne, Mariam, 
for your servant Laddie, O oh Lord, and for your servant Kim, who we pray on this day for and forevermore. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Again, we pray, O oh Lord, for those who bear fruit and do good works in your holy and all venerable church, for those who labor and for those who sing, and for the people here present who await your great and rich mercy. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. For you are merciful God who loves mankind, and to you we give glory to the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit, now and forever and to the ages of ages. Amen. Having ministered faithfully to the martyrs' needs, you did yourself emulate their sublime achievements in truth. When in contest you did not overcome the enemy, hence you do ever pour forth grace in abundant streams for all. O oh God, inspired Anastasia, the namesake of Christ's resurrection, the aid for all those who strive in piety. When, the, for, for, when from the tree far-famed martyr of the living God, shelter and defense of your servants, O oh Anastasia, we cry, rescue all those who call unto you in desperation of heart and deliver them from the plague of drugs that do evil unto hearts and minds and lead the souls of those to utter despair. Truly, through the grace given to you by our benefactor and savior, you can raise those who are deadened by the evil scourge. Lady, do you receive from your servants their prayers and deliver all of us from all sadness and necessity. My numerous hopes are placed before you, O Mother of our God. Guard me with care and with the shelter of your arms. Through the prayers of our Holy Fathers, Lord Jesus Christ, our God, have mercy on us and save us. Amen. May the dear Lord continue to protect us and be with us forevermore. And we have a blessing of having the relics of St. Anastasia amongst many others that we have here. She was a fourth century saint and she was known to be those one who helped through her prayers and through her, her care, not necessarily with medication, but with her loving care to help those who were addicted and any mental health concerns. And she was known to visit the many people in Rome at that time who were uh, downtrodden or maybe were not seen as high in society based on their societal ability. And so we have a beautiful icon of her right here. And you'll see that she has a cross in her one hand, a cross in the icon held by the saint is indicative that they were a martyr, that they died a martyr's death for our Lord. So she's a martyr. And the other hand is holding um, a vessel or um, a reservoir for how she would go and anoint the people with, um, to ask that our Lord continues to be with them. So she is known in Greek, the descriptor of her as the saint is pharmacokalitria, which refers to she was the one who healed people from, you know, like pharmacy, right? Pharmaka is uh, drugs. So um, she was the one who helped people at this time. So we continue to ask for her intercessions in our monthly service, and you are welcome to come forth and venerate the icon here with the relics as well. God bless you all. Have a beautiful day. primary relic. Then a primary relic the part itself. So this is a bone from a fragment of her body, which is distributed throughout the world. Um, I can say
say that I